As a public health researcher, I value the precautionary principle. As we continue to clean up air that we breathe and water that we drink, food is the only thing that we also intake every day, but has been adulterated with chemicals and genetic material to the level that I think is out of control. So I believe in organics, not only from the environmental conservation perspective, but from the principle of toxicology as well. Since everything is poisonous, less or no chemical in food is always healthier and safer than otherwise. The complexity of organic agriculture and working in the uh organic farming realm with organic farming really being treated as a, a complete system as a scientist is really exciting and intriguing and one of those reasons um, for it being exciting is the fact that you know, looking at it in a system I get to work with some some excellent colleagues throughout both the US and beyond um, so I get to interact with some great minds in agriculture to solve some of the, the, the grand challenges that face farmers into the next century. It's based on a whole series of ecological processes and principles that, uh, that manage soil fertility and, eco and species interactions rather than on a recipe of synthetic inputs. And this, uh, this means that it has the potential to maintain healthy agroecosystems over many years, but it also means that there's still a considerable amount of research that needs to be done in order to implement organic practices in particular places and for particular crops and animals. We didn't start growing for customers. We actually just grew for me, and uh, it was for health reasons. Um, we got invited to the uh, farmer's market in Brownsville, which was the first farmer's market that started here in the valley. And I got invited to be on the committee. We started, and I actually am an entrepreneur. I, I like business. So I saw the demand, and it was so huge, and nobody was actually filling it. So we expanded. Um, then my husband lost his job as a truck driver, and He's such an excellent farmer that we decided that was going to be his career.